Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to add a Find Empty Folder option to your right-click menu in Windows. So that way you could go to a drive or a directory and have it find any folders that happen to be empty. All right, so to do this we're going to be doing a simple registry edit here. So I have two files here, one to add the option, the one to remove it. So here's what the add option does. And then here's what the remove option does. Pretty much just gets rid of the find empty folders values there. Okay, so to configure this, we're just going to double click on the add find empty folders registry file here. Click on run, say yes to the UAC prompt and say yes to adding it to the registry, and then OK. OK, so now if we were to right click on a folder here, or a drive, let's say Documents, and of course for Windows 11 you have to go Show More Options unless you hold down Shift or use one of the other hacks to get rid of the uh, secondary menu there. All right, so now we have a Find Empty Folders. And this will open up a PowerShell window and tell you the path for the folders it found. So there are two folders here that it found. All right, let's try it on this entire drive here. So this one has four folders on it. You can see it gives you the uh, subfolders as well there to make it easy to find. And then of course you could just highlight it and copy and paste it into the address bar in File Explorer if you want to go right to that folder so you can take action on it. So you don't want to do this on, let's say, your entire C drive, for example, because you're going to find all kinds of stuff that you probably aren't going to want to do anything about. Plus, you'll get some errors, too, about uh, access being denied on certain folders. But you can see there are a lot of empty folders on the C drive as well under Windows. Okay, so if you want to remove the right-click option, you could just double-click on the Remove Find Empty Folders Registry file here. Go through the same process. All right, so now when we right-click, we don't have the Find Empty Folder option. Okay, so I will put a link in the description where you could download these two registry files, and then you could try it out for yourself. All right, thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe.